Hi, I'm Dan O'Malley from Cisco. I'm with Monique Lampson. Today, we're gonna demonstrate mobility. So years ago, we wanted uh, to help people when there's a disaster or when people are using two-way radios to take that traffic and put it over the IP infrastructure. So we have a card in a Cisco router that connects to a two-way radio and we turn that into voice over IP. So when I push my button, or Monique, why don't you push your button sure. on your two-way radio? It can come to these other devices. Two-way radio. <laughs> now you can tell that all these devices are on that same talk group. And when you push your button here, testing one, two. On your Cisco wireless phone, you come out to the two-way radio. And I have another wireless phone. Once you log into your talk group, you push your button on the side. Monique, can you hear me? <laughs> Coming in very loud and clear. And that's great. And you can see that it comes to our new Instant Connect mobile client. One of the things that customers like to know is who's on my talk channel. So you can see here's a list of users. So when this user pushes a button, testing one, two, you can actually see a talker ID on the top. So you know who's talking uh, when you're listening to that audio coming through your device, as well as who is logged into my talk group. And we, what we've done to enhance this is we have a couple other screens where people want to know the history on my channel. I might have had this in my pocket, and I don't know who's talking. So go ahead and push your button there, Monique. There you go. Even though, even though that's coming through, you have a history of somebody talking on that channel at a certain time. Uh, the next thing we've added to the Cisco Instant Connect mobile client is priority. Some users, if you're a manager or an important push-to-talk user, you want to have a highest priority on that channel so this user can change his priority. There might be an emergency situation where he wants his audio to go other, over other people's audio uh, in, a, in a time of emergency. There's also an emergency button. So when you push this button, you can create an emergency alarm into the IPix as well as the IP command infrastructure to have the emergency alarm. And next, people want to know, have I been connected to my channel? Have I lost data connectivity? Is it still up on that channel? And we have a screen here to actually show the statistics. What, uh, how long have you been connected uh, for, for that person on their device? So we've enhanced the user experience, adding these scrollable screens. And we also have a uh, purpose-built device from Sonom What's nice about this is it's IP68 and IP69 rated. What does that mean? IP68 means I can soak this underwater for three hours, and, I, and when I bring it up from the water, it still works. IP69 means that you can squirt a fire hose at this device, and it'll still work. Uh, and, and also, you can drop it from 10 feet. So if you drop this device, it uh, hopefully will rebound and your, your things will be working. And this company also has a three-year warranty. So we have a very rugged and durable device. It has a 100 dB speaker. So in places like manufacturing facilities or anywhere that it's loud, go ahead and push your button. You can hear it coming through this device. <laughs> uh, so this is our new uh, Cisco Instant Connect 4.9 mobile client. Show on a rugged device, on a bring your own device from Samsung Rugby Pro with the nice push to talk button on the side. Sonom also has a push to talk button on the side. We have our, our Cisco devices that push work with this. And we also have it working on Apple. So really it's a multi-device push to talk group. So if you'd like to add dispatching, you could through the IP command software and the IP command turrets or through the IPix dispatch console. So that's our mobility from Cisco. Thank you for watching. Thanks.